Okay, so it's the first full day we have in uh, Okanagan Falls. I believe it's Friday today. So we have a full day. I'm just going to hop in the shower, then we're going to go eat breakfast. Then I think we're going to might go down to the beach or we might go up to the other house, um, see what's going on with everyone else, uh, and then go down to the beach over there because <clears throat> it'll be a little bit less crowded. Um, and then we'll continue the rest of the day, so let's go get started. Breakfast. Okay, so the plan, I guess, today is we're either staying here or we're going into Penticton to the beach there to do the Lazy River. I'm not 100% sure what that is, so I guess we'll find out. Yeah, so go in for lunch up at the other place and then possibly drive into Penticton into the beaches there because from what I've heard, they're a little bit nicer. And then, yeah, we'll do that. The smoke isn't, like... Two, it looks a little bit better than yesterday, I guess, but there's definitely still some smoke. So that's the plan for today. Everyone's in the pool, so I decided to get my swimsuit on and hop in the pool. So let's get changed. Okay, we're done. We're now moving over to, uh, done swimming, moving over to the next place for lunch and then we're going down to the lazy river i guess which is an actual river they just rent tubes in and go down but going over to the other place for some hamburgers okay guys i'm in the back of the car i have my own air control this is luxury at its finest now we just have to drive over to caledon to get to the the, the parents house back at the old place the nice modern looking place with the glass. We're back there because we're grabbing all of our swimming stuff. I put some dry fit stuff on so it wouldn't be as hot, but we're doing that river float. So we go up to Penticton, you rent a tube, you float down, get to the bottom. They drive you a bus back up to the top and then we're gonna go to the beach and do whatever we want there. So that's the plan right now. Just gonna use the bathroom and get water and everything, get towels. And then we're gonna get on our way. Okay, we're in the car. Got my hat on, my sunglasses with their little straps so I can wear them around my neck, my nipple also. But yeah, so look at this. Pop those on. Oh, look at that. Oh, I look like I'm a little adventure boy. Pop them off. Don't worry about it. Oh, right around the neck. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. So it's about a 10, 15, 20 minute. Um, ride into Penticton so let's continue that ride okay so we're done the float it was pretty damn fun now there's like this little fair festival that they have here let's get some shots actually so there's like this jumpy thing where you can jump onto the trampolines there's a little obstacle course thing there there's go-karts over there there's probably some mini golf I would have to say there's like some little train thing this just looks like a lot of fun, I won't lie. Looks really cool, a lot of fun. Got a need for speed, yes. Okay, now we're just walking to the beach. Got spike ball in hand, ready to go hard. Yeah, that's my own. It's not good. The beach is bumping, ladies and gentlemen. There's that obstacle course, but you have to wear a life jacket and I ain't about that life, and you probably have to pay too, so I ain't about that life. Okay, everyone, we're done. I was on the thing, we actually did pay. There's the launching kids. I was just like a piece of meat. They're like, can you launch me? Can you launch me? And I was just launching kids, just one by one. But yeah, it was fun, but sometimes you just gotta give some kids the, the hand of God and just tell them what to do. Had to snitch on a few kids who aren't obeying the law. They're bullying kids, I had to be like, hey, Number, rule number three was no bullying, so sorry guys, I'm gonna have to tell you that. So that's how it was. We're gonna go back and have some lasagna now, so let's go eat some food. Okay, we're at the house. Everyone's inside. Drinking that Okanagan. Crisp apple. Gonna play some bocce and some football, so let's get it going. Going. Throws it. Boom. First throw. Sits it nice and close. Just pulled up to Tickleberries. Ice cream. 
Ice cream, ice cream, we all scream for ice cream. What would Kana eat? Like a dog. Dogs don't have ice cream. Guys, groundbreaking poop. Mermaid poop. Quail poop. Imagine like a little Indian comic coming through. Okay, we're back from Tickleberries. There's an absolute, you saw that increase in insane line. We had 17 people, and they're just like, there's just like too much math to do, so they're like, okay, $75. So we got it for like 75 bucks, which was way cheaper than it would have been, so. That's always good to get cheap ice cream, so we're gonna go to bed, play some games probably. So that'll be it for today. Tune in tomorrow for another video. Peace out. Thanks for watching, see you later.